everyone. Haven't seen you for a long time. I hope you missed me at least a little. Today, as usual, I'll try to cheer you up with a new game. I'll show you how hard it is for girls in a new game. But I hope you enjoy this video, like it and leave your comment, because it depends on you and your activity under the video, whether we will go through this game. And yes, I know that you are somehow not subscribed to our channel, so subscribe soon and let's go play a new game. Luck is on my side. Coming right up. No sweat. Should have been more careful. Don't worry, you won't feel a thing. Charge! Right! Let's get it done. When your heart starts racing, slow down and take a moment. That's far enough. Eden, did you think I'd let you escape so easily? Malastar! I'll start with you. This fire raging inside me. I'll quench it with a traitor's blood. Damn it. Words aren't getting through to him. We don't have time to deal with Ballastar. If you don't want to die here, run like your life depends on it.
Cap. Loud and clear. Be that easy. Ballastar! Eden, this place will be your grave. Run them down! That's far enough. I'll start with you. inside me. I'll quench it with a traitor's blood. Fierce 
and costly war. And at its end, he arose, the Conqueror King. His power grew, consuming the continent. Before long, he had crowned himself Emperor of the World. With a new world came a new way of life. One system of currency, one body of law, one empire. Bound by this new order, it seemed for a time that the chaos had finally ebbed. Until that day. Prophecy of ruin silenced on the spot. But the high priest's death was only the beginning. From that day forward, the emperor's heart was gripped by madness. He scoured the pages of history, burning books. Even the great spire was laid to waste. But no matter how hard he tried to silence them, the words of the high priest echoed in the emperor's ears. Close one. Hanging in there? Please, we're all loyal subjects here. I beg you, forgive the bad manners of a foolish boy. After all, today should be a celebration of our glorious Emperor. You wouldn't want him to get his boots bloody over one measly silver, now would you? I've killed rats like you for less. Consider yourself lucky.
And then what happened? Oh, they say that after the festivities had come to an end, the Emperor was never seen again. Some believe he has passed away. Others believe he has ascended to godhood. What's that supposed to mean? Is he dead or what? No, wait, it's almost over. Come on. You've heard that fairy tale a thousand times. Exactly. I want to know what happens next. Who cares? It's got nothing to do with us. Speaking of us, where's Leon? Oh, uh, last I saw him, he was in the square. Aw, oh, what's the matter? You two fighting again? Oh, come on. Why do you have to say it that way? You make me sound like a little kid. Yeah, you're nowhere near that mature. Anyway, Leon got held up by Pavlo. Town Chatterbox strikes again. Nice knowing him. We can't just leave him. Pavlo will talk himself out soon enough. I'm not so sure about that. Come on, let's go rescue him. I'm telling you, you guys did me a huge favor. Ever since those damn rebels camped out on the road to Hollisburg, it's been a nightmare moving goods in and out. Especially with my poor mother being so sick. If it weren't for your help with that medicine, I don't know what I would have done. It does my heart good seeing her up and moving around again. I don't even want to imagine what might have happened otherwise. I got it, Pablo. You already told us. Remember? I just wanted you to know I appreciate it. Oh, that reminds me. Where's Eden? I wanted to thank him personally. Ah, there you are. Eden! Hey! Thanks a bunch for that thing with the medicine. Pablo, it's fine. You already thanked me. I know, I know, but things were so hectic back there. I just wanted to make sure you knew. Don't worry about it. Do us a favor sometime, and we'll call it even. Absolutely. Though I don't know what help I could be. Well, whatever you need, just call out my name and I'll come running. Will do. For now, you just focus on taking care of that old lady. Oh! You're right, it's almost time to give Mother her medicine. I'd better be going. Thanks again. Ugh, oh, thank the gods. I thought he'd never shut up. He's not so bad. <laughs> Says the guy who took off running the second he showed up. Who, me? No, I was just, you know, huh? Now, don't even try it. I called out to you a dozen times. Well, that explains the distant shouting. Ugh. So much for brothers in arms. All right, children, settle down. Now that that's over with, why don't we go celebrate? Hey, now you're talking, brother. Days like today call for a nice, stiff drink. Move aside, please. I'm looking for Eden. What's their problem? Why not take that off and let us have a proper look? Seriously? You got a problem, friend? Wait, are you Eden? At your service, ma'am. Soon as we deal with these guys. So you're the big shot she won't shut up about. Heh. <laughs> Trying to look good in front of the lady? 
Nah, I'm plenty good looking already. Besides, unlike you, I don't have to try. Cocky bastard, ain't he? All right, I've had enough. Take him down! Have it your way. Francisco, Leon, get ready. You'll regret challenging me, kid. I'll break every bone in your body. If I were you, I'd stop talking. You're about to embarrass yourself. Now, bring it on. It's up to me. I may not be smart, but I know how to hurt. No matter how careful you are, all it takes is one mistake. Hey, brother! Looks like there's a puddle up ahead. Right. Everyone mind your footing! Don't fight smarter! You got it, Cap. Faith will never betray me. Francisco the Bold has arrived! It's a shame, spilling blood. Stronger the heart. Didn't even break a sweat. Now then, I believe the mysterious hooded woman had some business to discuss. I'd like to hire you. You can't afford us. Francisco, take it easy. 
What am I wrong? You're always doing favors for people, but what, what about us, huh? I'm sick of working for free. Please, I can give you however much money you want. Oh, Francisco the Bold at your service. How may I be of assistance, my lady? Excuse me, but would it be possible to go somewhere more private? We can talk at the hideout. This way. Hey, Cap? Who's that with you? She a uh, lady friend of yours or something? Client. Ah, uh, just shut up and move. Please, take a seat here, ma'am. Thank you. These are our friends, Robin and Robert. All right, now let's hear it. Why were you looking for me? I've heard you're the person to go to for any problem in Lynetta. They say you'll take on any job, no matter how dangerous. Sorry, who are you again? Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sarah. I need you. I need you to rescue my sister. Rescue her? From what? She in jail or something? Yes. Look, ma'am. I don't know what you've heard about us, but we're not those kind of mercenaries. We do honest work for honest pay. No, please, I'm begging you. My little sister's life depends on it. It's all because of that damned Lord Rodrigo. That man, he does whatever he wishes, no matter how vile. Even my husband, they... They killed him. Rodrigo had him murdered. He's obsessed with me! Hang on. Didn't we hear something about this? Remember that rumor a while back? They said Lord Rodrigo took in a widow and her family. Oh, yeah. Everybody thought the little toad had finally found a heart. He most certainly has not. A demon of a man. He told me if I didn't marry him, he would have my sister beheaded. I had no choice. <sighs> So much for Noble. That bastard! I always knew he was rotten right from the start. You barely knew he existed. Well, I know now. Knock it off. So, how did your sister end up in jail? I tried my best to put on a brave face, but Andrea, she saw right through me. One evening at dinner, she couldn't take it anymore. She leapt over the table and attacked him with a carving knife. Andrea's always been headstrong, but something like this. Attempted murder of a noble, huh? Yeah, that'll do it. He swore he'd see her hang no matter what it took. I refuse to let that happen. I refuse to let my little sister die. Ah, hell. Here's all the money I have. If it's not enough, I, I can try to find more. I'm begging you. Please. Well, I don't know about you, brother, but I've heard enough. Let's raise some hell and bust a little lady out of there! Slow down. Let's think this through. We're talking about a heavily fortified prison here. You telling me you're just gonna sit there after hearing a tale like that? Easy, Francisco. He's just saying we can't rush in without a plan. That place is swarming with guards. It's not gonna be easy. Open up! You're all under arrest. Drag them out here. What the hell? Hey, you guys can't just barge in here. Tell it to Lord Rodrigo. 
We're not going anywhere until you tell us why. Seems like these degenerates need to be taught a lesson. Can't say I'm surprised, but that doesn't make this any less frustrating. You really intend to put up a fight, don't you? You're the one picking a fight, Carl. What the hell's your problem? You know I'm only following Lord Rodrigo's orders. What cause does he have to arrest us? He doesn't need a reason. You should know that by now. Lords give the orders, we carry them out. Now drop the weapon and come with me. Like hell I will. We're not going anywhere until you tell us what we're being charged with. All right, boy. Have it your way. Don't blame me for what happens next. Robin, stop them from advancing as much as you can. You got it, Cap. I can handle that. No matter how careful you are, all it takes is one mistake. fight the whole bunch? Why don't I just charge through that gap and take out their leader? Forget it. Trying to move past an enemy that way will stop you dead in your tracks. Stay calm and focus on defeating the front line. You can do this. You can do this. Got it, Cap. <laughs> Luck is on my side. <laughs> if your blood runs hot, keep your head cool. 
You got it! These guys are stronger than I expected. If you get hurt, drink a potion when you have the chance. Think deeply. Act quickly. I may not be smart, but I know how to hurt. Should have been more careful. Faith will never betray me. a new day. It's time to get focused. As soon as we get within range, he'll make his move. Let's roll! Um, where are we going again? No problem! starts racing slow down and take a moment let's get it done Destination doesn't matter. It's the people you're with. Right. Loud and clear. <laughs> what have you got to say now? <laughs> Your skills are wasted in Lynetta. But you're still just a common mercenary.
I have my orders. If you continue resisting, you leave me no choice. Enough. Like I said, you're coming with us. And like I said, I want to know the charges. Charges? Let me go! I said let me go! The charge is Lord Rodrigo wants his lady back. Simple as that. What the? Now come along quietly. And let's avoid any more unnecessary bloodshed, shall we? Eden, if you get caught, it's over. Let's give him the girl and beat it for now. Leon's right, Cap. Hell with that, brother! Let's give him a fight they won't forget! Tell you what, you do as I say and your friends were never here. That's the best offer you're gonna get. Hang back. We might be able to use this to our advantage. All right. So long as you keep your word about my friends, I'll go with you. Good choice. Eden. Be careful, brother. Don't sweat it. I'll be back before you know it. Cap! You better pay your poor old pal a visit in jail. Got it? All right, men. Move out! So, what's the plan? Why are you looking at me? I thought you knew what he meant. No, uh -oh. This is about to get messy. Sarah, how dare you defy me? After all I've done for you, this is my thanks. Hey! Knock it off! Running away behind my back is low enough, but to steal from me? Are you so blinded by greed as to abandon your own sister? Please, my little sister, spare Andrea. I'll do anything you want. Anything, you say? Very well then. Kill him. Sarah. We both know this wasn't your idea. Now prove you've learned your lesson. I... I can't. Please. I suppose you don't value her life after all. All right. I've had just about enough of this. What? How dare you? If I were you, I'd keep that forked tongue in my mouth, before you lose it. What are you all doing standing around? Get this insect out of my sight! Sounds good to me. All right, Eden. You've successfully gotten yourself thrown in jail. Now what, genius? Hey, guard! Over here. I'm talking to you. Let me out of here, damn it! Knew I should have gutted that little toad when I had the chance. Guess that makes you the sister. Excuse me? Andrea, right? Who's asking? Wait, you're saying my sister hired you? Yep, your own personal liberator. At your service. Unbelievable. So, you got yourself thrown in here just to bust me out? 
Uh, sure. Let's go with that. Well, then what are we waiting for? I want that bastard dead! Easy. One thing at a time. You're not killing anybody from in here. Fine. Then what's the plan? The plan is... Uh, a work in progress. <laughs> are you telling me you came here with no idea how you'd be getting out? Well, it's not like I had a lot of time to think about it. I'm here, aren't I? Now, if you're through criticizing your rescuer, let's put our heads together. Are you finding prison to your liking, my lady? Where do I know that woman from? Oh, that's the Inquisitor. The Capitol sent her here a few months ago. She discovered Rodrigo and his men had been stealing from local merchants. Tried to do the right thing and turn him in. You know what they say. No good deed goes unpunished. Alright. This guy's really starting to irk me. My monthly report is overdue. The Capitol won't appreciate an Inquisitor going missing in your domain. Oh, don't you worry, your pretty little head. I've got that all figured out. Haven't you heard? There are uprisings exploding all over Artemisia. If the Capitol caught wind that one of their precious highborn bureaucrats was a rebel sympathizer... Well, best to deal with something like that quietly, don't you think? So you're going to frame me, is that it? As my soldiers were patrolling the forest paths, they were shocked to witness the Inquisitor meeting with a rebel envoy. You assume the Emperor will trust your word over mine? Ah, yes. Silly me. But then... How can a dead woman testify? Do you imagine it will reflect well on you? That an alleged spy fooled you for weeks? Fool me? Nonsense. I was simply biding my time while I rooted out her insidious conspiracy. If anything, I expect I'll be rewarded for dispatching a few ugly pests. A few? As I said, the dead cannot testify. You... You're mad. Oh, come now. Don't look so surprised. Your fate was sealed the moment you entered this prison. Did I hear that right? He's gonna frame all of us? Damn. He really is rotten to the core. Okay, tea time's over. We need a plan, and we need it now. I know, I know. Don't rush me. Uh, this would be so much easier if Leon and Francisco were here. What did he say? He's gonna kill us all! I didn't do anything! Like hell, I'm gonna die in this dump. I got a family to get back to! We all have one way out of this. Rebellion. Rebellion. It's the only way out of this place. And easier said than done. Be very careful before you wager other people's lives on a coin toss. I'll take a coin toss over death any day. These people have families in town. If you raise a hand to the Empire and fail, are you prepared to bet those lives too? I thought you were here to rescue me. Or would you rather sit around and wait until they drag us off to die? I'm saying you need to think it through. All of you. This isn't a game. 
It's treason. Once you open that box, there's no closing it again. I'd rather go out with a sword in my hand than a boot on my neck! Freedom or death! This much is crazier than I thought. Eden, if you take the lead, we'll all rally behind you. I'll follow you until the very end. All right. But forget all this talk about dying. Because we're all getting out of here alive. I sure hope Eden's doing all right. We'll see soon enough. Did you bring it? Yeah, I scraped together every gold piece we had. I don't know what he was hinting at earlier, but hopefully this isn't too far off the mark. You think we have enough? <sighs> if they want more than this for a bribe, it's robbery. Who goes there? Evening, friend. Hey, maybe you can help me out. See, I found this purse of coins just laying around. I forgot to ask earlier. You spoke to Sarah, right? Is she doing okay? <laughs> I guess you two are sisters after all. She was just as focused on you. She's endured so much for my sake. All I've done is make things worse. Why don't we save the self-pity for later? After I get you back to her in one piece. <laughs> right. Sure. Eden! About time. About time? Are you kidding me? Do you have any idea how much I spent to get in here? I'm only gonna say this once, so listen up. We're busting all these people out and leaving Lanetta. We're doing what? Eden, I, I know you like playing hero, but... This is pushing it. Three nights from now, I need you guys to create the biggest diversion since the dawn of time. Can't we just sneak you out and lay low for a while? Sure, if you don't mind all these people dying. Fine, fine, fine. I got it. Remember, it has to be big. Even bigger than that time at the Harvest Festival. Understand? You can count on me. Simple plan. The best ones are. Well, I guess that takes care of that. How are you doing, by the way? You seem awfully unfazed by all this. I had a feeling my arrest was coming. I arranged some things beforehand. Then we're all set. Now let's start gathering anything we can use as a weapon. It's time. It's an emergency! They're in the plaza! What is it? What's going on? There's a riot! Hurry! Everyone to the square, now! But the captain told us not to leave this post under any circumstance! That's why he sent me. He needs the strong fighters like you there. Now go! Go! Well done. When did you bribe him? I didn't. He's one of mine, an escort of sorts. He's been gathering intelligence in Lynetta for weeks. Let's be off, my lady. Everyone, grab your weapons. Remember, our number one goal is survival. Hey, 
Thank you for watching this video to the end. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and rate this video like or dislike, because it is you who decide whether we will go through this game further. Bye-bye!